Our plane. Oh. Doesn't look too trustworthy. <laughs> so Updates. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh, oh no! We're here in London, finally, guys. <laughs> the flight wasn't as scary as I thought it would be. Still scary. I don't like flying that much. It was fun. Uh, was, yeah. Okay. Big uh, fun. Big big fun. Much lots lots of fun. And now we're gonna go to the stand <laughs> and and uh, gone into London. Into London. Let's see. First time London ever. The magical process of buying the oyster cup. We were so smart and tried to go to this machine that doesn't accept any notes, even though it says notes accepted up there. Big and fat. Smart tourists. We finally made it. And uh, here it is the Oyster Karte. Die haben es eilig. Wow, das hat mich verwirrt. <laughs> Diese ganze Konstruktion hier verwirrt mich. Super busy. Ladies and gentlemen. Now that we're here, we're being greeted by typical. London weather, rain, clouds, same as in Germany pretty much at the moment. We're trying to find the uh, hotel, the hostel, the guest house at the moment. Pelsi is uh, figuring it out on his phone. And yeah, we'll see if we can get there without being completely soaked. What is this? A castle flat share thing? <laughs> shack. A shack, a castle shack. <laughs> the cool assassin. Only the bigger, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> here's, here's space for, for a pedestrian walk, not anymore. <laughs> this looks nice, little cafe right near where we are supposed to have our house, or well, the guest house. Haven't seen it yet. It's 84, we're supposed to go to 86. Oh, that's it up. It's blow. There it is. So we have to go here at 2 pm, and now it's what? What's the time? Nine something. Nine. <laughs> Yoo -hoo. Yeah. Yay! So we have to stroll around the city for another. Yeah. yeah let's, lots of hours. Let's maybe go around. Here. Yeah. Let's go there. You can it's fill up your technology. future technology. <laughs> can fill up your electric gas. <laughs> so <laughs> so <Yes>. el electricity. <laughs> so we were actually really lucky. We just stopped by the guest house, and then an older lady came out and said, like, Ah, oh, yeah. If you want, you can come two hours earlier because I have to go to the doctors. I was like, Yeah, cool. <laughs> Definitely we can check in two hours early and um, then do whatever with the rest of our time because I don't have to be at the office thingy of the best summer ever thing before 4 p.m. so that's good and um, leaves us with a lot of time to do stuff beforehand I love these, uh, oh, these chimneys huh? what's an ambulance? Klötzchen with the blauen Zeichen drauf das kommt auch nur von hier Klötzchen? Italien hatten die auch diese Verkehrsinselteile also diese uh, these what, what are they called? Traffic island things. <laughs> These blocks Definitely. with the with the with the arrow on it. We're just uh, fascinated by the architecture here <laughs> and the infrastructure, everything. And the cars. And the, and the cars, yeah. Big cars, good cars. Apparently, Islington isn't that bad of an area. <laughs> I asked a friend online, and she said, um, "Oh yeah, well, it's not the best area, but it's okay." <laughs> I was like, "Okay," and uh, now it seems actually really nice. Know. If it's affordable for us, it's, uh, it's for the best area <laughs> we can be at. <laughs> exactly, exactly. But it looks really nice, like all the gardens here. And look at that. This looks really, really like comfy, home, homely, Hi, heimelig, homely, Home, homely, <laughs> homely. Ah, uh, of course, the standard tourist attraction, the telephone booth. Time travel commences, Pelzi. That was fun. The pig and the butcher, a pub and eating. Pelzi got himself some very healthy looking sandwiches. Freshly made. Fresh, freshly made five years ago. 
refrigerator. At some point, it was perfect. Ah, da sind Kinder drin. I wonder when stuff opens in London or, or like here. Because nothing's open, no pub is open. And they're probably opening like in the afternoon or evening. I don't really know. Is it good? It's food. Doesn't matter. Not, not too bad. It looks cool, whatever that is. Seems to be like a mini mall or something. Might check it out later. The flower shop, no, it's another supermarket, Wait Rose. Never heard of that before. A little gift card stand, or like a greeting card stand, whatever you want to call it. It's cute. We got the same things like in Germany and when, when you have a fun fair or something. And we have the same kind of things. Now, Patsy, come on. Yours accepted. I'm the one you want. We're in London for the first time, and what do we do? We go to McDonald's. Is it 10 or 11? No idea. One, uh, my one phone is showing both. <laughs> one hour back, usually. Being abroad or being home? Same, same. Yeah. <laughs> That's confusing. I have a sausage and egg muffin with no sausage. And I had a little potato thing and an orange juice. Pat says, have any coffee because How he. Was the potato thing. Very, very nice, actually. See? Very nice. Guess what, guys? Blue is calling at the moment <laughs> from Straya. Um, our, our flight was good. Our flight was pretty good, like with Ryanair, a little, little bit bumpy, but not too much. Um, and very, really short. We were like 15 minutes ahead of schedule as well, so it was good. And um, yeah, all good. Pizza's favorite favorite store, the Fat Face. <laughs> all the things have awesome names here. Like the butcher and the the pig and the, um, the nags head. Really cool names all the time. Cyber candy guys. They can't go in because they have a coffee. They can film inside. <laughs> British fire truck. Got it all in now. All in. You're only allowed to go in here when you're five people, five guys to be precise. What's that? Hot dogs, sandwiches, all different kinds of things. It's the first five guys I have ever seen. Do you have that in your city? Because it's new to me. The Schnecke und der Salat. Oh, here's a Kino. Godzilla! Noch so ein altes. Guck mal hier, wo die das oben so drauf packen. That's good. Old school cinema here. I love that. My Nando's. Haven't seen that since I've been in Australia. You can eat everywhere here. Like, you just need to walk a few meters and there's a new restaurant. I love that. A really good restaurant. Yeah, exactly. Possible. And we have to drive like 50 kilometers at home to get something like that. Even remotely, that's good. It's so sad. Hello, Mr. Bones. Lost again. Yeah, we're gonna start in love, no? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's do it. English fire station. German ones look completely different. There's a big, big ass church. <laughs> And we're trying to find our way back on. Actually, we don't because it's way too early. So we're pretty much just waiting until we can check in and we will take a shower. Not together. I will just take a shower by myself. <laughs> and then hopefully, <laughs> hopefully we can uh, go to the city soon again. Now it's starting to rain a bit more again. So hopefully we can get inside soon. Dorf Trottel sucht Dorf. Village idiot seeks village. <laughs> That's hilarious. That's a really nice pub and uh, it's just next to our our uh, guest house that's good too we can just go out of the door and, and drink <laughs> and we can just stumble back into our house as well perfect well. perfect we had all, the money we spent on drinks. <laughs> all our money we spent on drinks and <laughs> uh, not yet not yet <laughs> and the food they do thai food here every evening from six Oh, here You're as right, well. Food, yeah. Oh, yeah. awesome! Yeah, yeah definitely. Six o'clock. Cool. Yeah. Um, and they do quite a nice Sunday roast on a Sunday at mm. lunchtime. Like right? you know, a nice Sunday roast. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> I, I don't. I, I like the roast, but um, since last year, I don't eat meat anymore. Oh, right. 
Oh, uh, but but I love well, the taste a, of roast. They have a vegetarian option. Ah, oh, really? You know, because they call it a nut roast, which is vegetarian. That is awesome. Cool. Like in, in Germany, you wouldn't get that in the traditional pub, really. They wouldn't have a vegetarian option. That's what I. That's that's they nice. Even consider it. Yeah, they wouldn't <laughs> consider it. Like, ah, some do, but not not many. What's this pub's name again? Or the They're having for the arms. Ah, cool. Just so that people know and then can come visit themselves. Yeah. <laughs> 19th century. So this is our room. It's our bed. <laughs> Can't even through the person destroyed something instantly. <laughs> the drawer. <laughs> good, good job, German engineer. <laughs> yeah, and this is our cute little room. We have a little cupboard here. I haven't actually, haven't actually looked inside yet. Yeah. I mean, we don't really have that much stuff, anyways. Ooh. Ooh and uh, a little little couch. It's nice. A little desk here. It's already full of shit. Just a good experiment. Nice try. Yeah, it's plugged out, is it? Oh, ah, yeah, they have these. Yeah, yeah, these switches here in England. England. Hmm. Oh well, we don't need that. We have this luxurious light here. And we live here in the cellar. <laughs> Direct with schöner Aussicht auf den Müll. <laughs> Nett. Noch ein Licht, was nicht funktioniert. Aber um ehrlich zu sein, brauchen wir das auch nicht. Was wir brauchen ist das Bett zum Pennen. Mache ich jetzt auch mal den Betttest gleich. Okay, ja, passt. Ja, was? Ist das eine Wolke? Ja. <lacht> ja. Ja, bitte. Auf eine Wolke. Ähm, ja, mit dem Strom. Entweder sind die alle durchgeballert. Hm? Hä? Nee. Also die Lampen, ja, das kann sein. Strom, ja, gucken wir gleich mal. It's perspective from the bed. Tells us figuring out what to do tonight. Watching X-Men, maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. If we're not too tired. We already had a pint at the um, bar next door. Like, it's really just two meters. And I feel kind of drunk. I need to brush my teeth so that the people from the interview won't notice. Um, don't know if, you've, if I've actually told you this before. Like, I'm going to go to this interview slash casting thing for the best summer ever project sponsored by Malibu. They look for four people that... Um, like drive in a camper van around Europe and then America for like 40 days and do a challenge every day so um, there's a casting for that and uh, I, I got shortlisted and they invited me to London and since I'm in London anyways I can just go and uh, check it out no pressure <laughs> the cinema is 20 minutes from here that's good we passed it already we walked while walking here so 20 minutes walking yeah that's good so we can watch a movie tonight or so, or tomorrow, whenever. It's a pubs and bars blog. 10 top London beers and places to drink them. That sounds nice. Let's do that. <laughs> Check it out. Check, I'm checking it out with the camera in my hand. Check one, check two. Where can you scroll? On the... Well, on the... Up and down buttons. Really? Yeah. There? No. The, the, the ones with the arrows on, yeah, that an arrow representing down. <laughs> Let's just scroll down. Oh, that makes sense. Thanks, Spencer. You're a wise man. Engineering sure has its benefits. <laughs> it does.